Hey, hey lovelies, welcome today. I am going to be focusing on pretty much redoing our guest bathroom. Um, we really haven't done a lot to it since we've been here for the past two and a half years. So I thought that this time I would go ahead and just brighten it up and really just um, bring some spring into the bathroom. Now the bathroom is painted and you'll notice that the walls are a little bit darker, so I really want to just focusing uh, focus on bringing in some whites and you know just kind of brighten it up as much as possible. But stay tuned. I'm so excited to bring you know some brightness into my home this year, um, and I'm excited to share with you guys. So this is what our guest bathroom has looked like over the past couple years, and it's really not bad. It's definitely functional, and our guests have definitely enjoyed using it, but he felt like it just needed um, some change. And so you'll see what um, I have on the shelves. I actually have this artwork that I get questioned about quite a bit, um, but it was a gift during our wedding, and my brother-in-law um, actually is an artist and it was something that he um, sketched and I just thought that it was appropriate for the bathroom. I don't know but anyways I'm really willing to just change things up and you know I love grays. Um, I love the navy color but I feel like this bathroom just definitely needs a facelift and we do have this glass door for the shower and I hate that 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 is exposed so I decided to put a shower curtain there um, so we shall see how everything turns out <laughs> So as you can see, it definitely brightened up this area. I'm not too sure how I feel about the shower curtain just yet. I 
love the shower curtain, but I'm not sure if I'm really feeling it for this particular space. Um, I do like how everything came out on the shelves. Of course, I may play around with it, but for now, um, I like how everything looks. Um, one of the things that hubby and I always do is we take the um, shampoo and conditioner and lotions from hotels. Comment below if you do the same thing. Um, but we actually... Um, donate a ton of the products during Thanksgiving time we uh, or the holidays we make blessing bags using the shampoos and conditioners and then um, I will actually just fill up these containers so that our guests have extra um, products in case they forget any of their products. It's always good just to have on on hand, but if you are one that takes uh, the shampoo, conditioner, and lotion from your hotel, uh, give this video a like and let me know that I am not alone in that. Um, but I do love how it looks in these apothecary jars um, when they are filled up. Overall, I think everything came out so great and I'm really loving um, how how bright it looks in here because the paint is a little bit dull and I really didn't want to spend any time painting. So let me know what your favorite item um, in the bathroom was or if you have any suggestions, um, maybe replace the shower curtain or maybe add in some other things. Whatever you feel uh, might look or help this space out. I would love to hear your opinions. Thank you guys so much for watching and if this video inspired you or if you liked um, how everything came out, again, I'd appreciate a like and if you're not currently subscribed, I would love to have you join our YouTube family and you know I have so many more ideas coming up that uh, I just am so excited to share so make sure that you are subscribed and make sure that that notification bell is clicked that way you get notified on all of my videos thank you guys so much again this is just such an amazing journey and it's really because of you guys and your kind comments so have a wonderful day and I will see you in the next one